Hi guys, got a little challenge here. A plastic uh, coat hook. Uh, don't know what to call it really. Clearly it's what a pair of leggings came on in the shop. So it's to be thrown out. It's not required. So I just wondered whether I could make a rubber band powered car out of it. A couple of things that make it difficult. These bottom sections don't lie flat. So ideally we'd just put a tube across the end there for the front axle and a tube across the back for the back axle and chop the middle section out so we can wrap the rubber band round but because that's got a bit of a bend on it that's not going to be quite so convenient obviously we'll take the hook off I think that just unscrews but I think I might try a little bit of heat See if we can just get that to bend flat. If we can't, then, well, it's not a big problem. I might just trim it out of the way. Probably doesn't show up, but I just heated it and pushed it flat. Yep, I think that'll do. Hot glue gun on. Going through my junk pile or stockpile. I've got these wheels that I made from plywood, but they happen to be black, which will match rather nicely with this black, uh, whatever it is, coat hanger. Um, and I've got some black drinking straws. So. I'll hot glue black drinking straws on both ends. That should keep them parallel so the car should go straight if we're lucky. We'll put the wheels on. I've even got this barbecue uh, skewer that's already got a bit of barbecue skewer stuck on T-shape. So if we arrange for that to go in the middle there, then that will be an easy way of hooking the rubber band on. I should cut that centre section out. I wonder if we can do it with cutters. Soon find out if it all shatters, won't we? That came apart all right. That one's split though, not so good. We'll put a bit of hot glue under that to hold it back together. Yeah, so drinking straws need to be sticking out a bit. About that long. We slide them on there and when we glue it in place it should hold it all together. Lighting's not very good tonight, only using one light. Let's move that round there a bit. Right. Put a little bit of hot glue on there first. The 
just to get it to hold in place. When that's cooled down, I'll put some right the way around. Can't see it because it's all black and in shadow, can you? Well, we'll see it when it's finished. There we go. Drinking straw hot glued on that end, drinking straw hot glued on that end. It's a bit big, that bit of wood sticking out. I might trim that down a bit. Yeah, that's more like it. Nice and tight on there. You want them nice and tight so they grip the axle. Front end doesn't really need to be quite as tight because they're just freewheeling rather than trying to grip the axle. You can always put a bit of super glue on them though if you want to make sure they don't come off. Right, the only other thing I want to do, if you just attach the rubber bands, I've got some white ones, straight round like that, you might crush the tube there and you might stop the axle from turning. So I'm going to melt a hole through there with my nail on a stick. Nail on a stick, that means I can heat that up in a flame and it's well away from my hands so I don't burn my hands. So I'll just heat that up, push it through there so we've got a hole and then put the rubber bands through the hole. There we go, melted a hole through. So we should be able to push the rubber band through the hole. Might need to, oh no, that's it, that's through. Then push the rest of it through that loop. So that's all right on that end, and then at the other end, that's just long enough to go on there. So we can wind it up. And away we go. Do that again in case we missed it the first time. What you don't want to do is let the rubber band get caught up against either side because that will actually stop it unwinding. So if I do that and keep going, there it's actually rubbing up against the side now. And then, oh, yeah it did come off but it, it can easily get jammed. Well, we'll give that a try now.
summary time. What have we got? We've got a plastic coat hanger uh, that my wife bought some stuff in the supermarket. A pair of tights, I think, or leggings, I think they're called. And I've just glued drinking straw front and back. I've got bamboo skewers for axles front and back. The wheels are cut from plywood. I made them for one of my previous projects and painted them black, so I thought it looked rather nice all in black. Uh, for the rubber band, I did actually melt a hole through the front there so I could attach the rubber band without wrapping it round the drinking straw because that might have collapsed the drinking straw onto the axle. At the back, we've got an extra bit of wood just glued T-shape onto the axle to make it easy to hook rubber band onto. And this particular coat hanger had actually got a bit of a bend in it so I heated it up to flatten it. That one works quite nicely. Quite pleased with that one. Quite like the look as well, all in black.